Good day, people. Welcome back to Brain Bank TV. Uh, this is the Roulette Challenge, um, and um, as usual, we'll be um, using the strategy on multiple accounts, trying to achieve the uh, daily goal of no loss and some profits. Um, not always the case; doesn't always happen. We've had some terrible runs um, over the last few days on one of the platforms, Triple Eight, and for that reason, um, Triple Eight's been exempt for from the challenge until um, as and when I can. Um, get the new changes applied to the accounts um, with regards to the spend count and whatnot um, closer to the end of the month so we'll see how that when we um, um, update those um, changes but for now we'll be um, continue, continuing on can't get my words out from where we uh, left off last time um, with regards to the free spend count uh, we're going to do that on four platforms excluding triple eight uh, so let's get on with it we're on London Roulette on William Hill. 59.70 is our balance. We've got free spins to do. I don't really ask for a lot when I do these free spins. So I really thought um, it was going to work without me having to tweak the strategy too much. Um, but maybe it would um, work over an extended, extended period of time. But what do you get for that? I don't know. Like... The point I'm trying to make is just because I've had four days of um, terrible losses on it for now doesn't mean it's a write-off because I don't know what the results would be in the next three months. Do you see where I'm getting, getting at with that? So it's very hard to determine how it, it would um, work out for you, really. Um, but... Um, this is the third... Right guys, um, sorry about that, I have a, had a little bit of a technical difficulty. Um, so we managed to complete the free spins on William Hill without any issues, got the 6270. Um, so I've just put that down on the record and I'm just going to try and get a Sky uh, Roulette up. <laughs> as this is the second platform we'll be dealing with today. Hopefully we can um, get another smooth run on here. We shall see. Is this a sky or a sky? This sky. 62, 63 we have on here. Is that right? <sighs> Just bear with me a second, guys. Yeah, guys, unfortunately, it turns out I'm having some major issues with Sky. Can't seem to get the platform up and running. Um, so we're going to have to come back to that one. For now, we're going to jump into Coral. Uh, 4507 is the uh, balance. We've got the free spins. Won't we finish? Once we um, conclude with Vladbrook, so I'm going to try and reattempt um, uh, the the login for, um, for uh, um, Sky and see if, if it works better then, but we'll see. Let's see if we can um, get these spins done. You've got a lot of 4 and 14s on here, man. Jesus. <laughs> oh, 4 and 14s. First spin, we've got 9 and 17. Um, hopefully, it's a smooth run again. Um, that's all you can ask for with these um, very specific kind of um, um, strategy that I've got going on. Yeah. So I've got three spins to do on here. I'm just going to go with the same uh, for the second spin. And uh, I'll, I'll see if I can change it over on third. Um, but for now, didn't smell any danger there. Hopefully um, that, stays, that remains the case after the spin. We shall see. Second spin, 9 and 17 again. What do you mean? To... Oh, oh, dealer change in progress. Second, uh, third and final spin. I mean, can I really get 4 and 14 again? I mean, I wouldn't be happy, guys, if I got 4 and 14 again. But it's a hard number. <coughs> It looks like a hot number on this board. Oh, it's a 
Hello guys, for the fifth um, time running I'm going to attempt to do this video. I can't, I can't seem to get the video completed without having some technical issues so um, do be patient with me, I do apologise for that. Um, I managed to complete the spins on Coral and I've got a balance of 46.57 which is the three spins and it's um, been good on that. So we're going to move on to the fourth platform, third platform third platform um, as we didn't um, yet do sky so we'll get back to that if um, we have any issues with that but just let me get the platform before lab breaks loaded up and we can get that free spins completed all right we have it up and running we're looking for pearl if I'm right on lab breaks let's just confirm that yeah 39 should be the balance do we have 39 here we do let's look for pearl and get this done with <coughs> and then once it, once this is completed we're going to attempt to revisit sky um, and see if we can get onto the platform um, but it's been get, having some real technical um, issues um, so for the last few days really I've been having issues trying to log on to the platform <coughs> sorry about my voice um, How are we going to get on? We've gone with 2 and 18 for the first spin. Fingers crossed, this is a smooth run. Okay, I already drink my water. 30, 4, 7, 5, 5, 0. Sorry for that. Okay. We've gone for 2 and 18 for the first spin. Um, the only issue I have is I always seem to select the numbers that lose eventually. So look, that's next door to 18. Look at that. When your luck's due, your luck is due. That's all I can say. That's all I can say. When your luck is due, your luck is genuinely due. Um, because that was next door to 18. What was the what was stopping it from landing on 18? I'm not sure because look at that. That's right next door to 18. So yeah, how are we going to get on? We've gone with 4 and 14 for the second spin as the missing numbers. We got 12. I'll take that. I will take that. Should we do 4 and 14 again? Why not? Why not? Although I have lost on 14 before. Um, I mean, this is just my preference. If you if you wanted to choose another um, another sequence number, then that's fine. You could have chosen your own sequence number, but this is uh, something that I thought was alright, and it turns out it is. Before I butt my own words. <laughs> So we got 20, no, 40, 50. I'll close this down. I think we've done three on there. 40, 60, 40, 50, yeah? It should be 40, 50. 40, 50. Bring this back down here. And yeah. Not bad. But we shall see what happens when that variable, the variable spin count changes from 3 to 5 to 10 spins. I think that's where it starts becoming quite exciting because would I have been able to go for 10 spins today and potentially have made, what's that, 5, 6, so 3, 4.50, about 5 or 6.50. Yeah, on the 10 spins, uh, would I have been able to do that? I don't know, but surely that would have made a, a much significant difference if I could have gone to three or four of them days without getting a loss on those spins. That's the idea. But we'll see what happens when I release those with the changes. For now, we're going to reattempt to access Sky Vegas. Give me one minute and I will attempt that. Looks like we might get lift off on this one this time. We shall see, 62, 63. Um, 
I'm not sure what goes on with their platform, but you need a good few times of refreshes to get it going. Um, don't think it's picking up the info from the server good enough. Come on, mate. Thank you, Sky Roulette. I think that's the right one, yep. And for the fourth spin, can we potentially get the free spin that we need? Um, I don't know. We shall find out in a minute. How can they table? Steven, how are you doing, mate? The 26 black that went out, landed in right beside Zero. Steven's just joined us on it. So Zero neighbors and in the class. Gone for 15 and 23 for the first spin. On the platform, Sky Roulette. It's weird how this ball barely looks like it's spinning. It's weird, real weird. Welcome, Boss Grody. So here it is. Yeah, right on here, section. Yeah, um. And the way it lands when it actually gets onto the numbers and tries to um, decide on what numbers to what number to land on, it kind of just looks like it floats around um, on top of them. Those little silver lines in the middle um, of those numbers, they're meant to kind of be like metal hard edges that makes um, gives the ball some sort of momentum to pick a bounce. But on this one, the, those um, edges aren't sharp at all. Those edges aren't sharp at all. So yeah, for the third and final spin, I'm going with 9 and 17. Um, I'll be honest with you guys, I had 9 and 17 in my head as soon as I picked 15 and 23 on the previous spin. I already had that in my head. So it's a situation like this where I already had a choice of numbers in my head where I think might be a safe option for me on the next spin but then if i lost on that would that be a choice of would that be a, a thing to say i lost based on the fact that i'd pre-selected a losing number right from the very start be, be prior to me even getting to that spin that is my um little conversation thing there who knows 64 13 is that right i think that's right 64 13. 64 All right, we're ready, folks. Cancel that. 64 13. And God, give me 150 here. And yeah, guys, finally we got through the day. Um, so it's not been the worst of. Which platform is this? This is quite a decent one, isn't it? It's actually Sky. Sky has actually lost me one since the start. Talk about having a flagship. This turns out to be a better flagship, or just as good of a flagship as this only has two losses. It's not actually been bad, it's just those few counts aren't good enough. I kind of have to have a way of making a little bit more to, to account for those times, um, to get those profits in a little bit quicker, but then the um, loss counts could count for that as well. So yeah, who knows how that is all going to turn out, but it doesn't actually look as gloomy as I thought. Um, Triple Eight makes it look really gloomy because of the brilliant start and then the rough end so far um but yeah hopefully we shall see those red lines by the way these are all missing days not losses the red are the losses so do be aware of that um hopefully closer to the end of the month when i'm making those changes i'm going to go through the data in here try and drop some um, conclusions or um, some some analysis as to how we approached um, as to how we um, dealt with the days that we've had this running for how much we're in loss um, how so, sort of just um, random stats to help us um, f uh, ch see whether or not it's something that would work um, with those changes but we'll see anyway 
Um, thank you for watching my video. I do appreciate um, the support I'm receiving from you guys out there. Um, if any of this is of interest to you, do share, subscribe and like the content. Um, it will be much appreciated. Um, but in any case, I'll be back with you guys tomorrow for some more episodes and um, with you guys with the new strategy and sorry, the new um, adjustments to the strategy at the end of the month. So do check that out. Definitely. All right. Thank you for joining me again and bye for now.